they were just so excited that they'd they'd got it and they could explain it. The style of the material is very engaging for pupils. They're learning things without realising that they've learnt them. By being able to put things on, to explore on the screen, to pose their own conjectures and then test them, that actually makes the learning far more powerful. We found that because everything was real um, to the students, they were able to visualise um, the maths. That was, that was quite good for them. And this encouraged a lot of discussions. I think normally, you know, they'd be fine and they'd be able to repeat to me that, you know, the gradient was the steepness and the y-intercepts where it crosses. But somehow, having it linked with the actual simulation really brought that home in a way that I haven't seen before. Today they had uh, a lesson and they looked at um, two lines, two parallel lines on the graph, and they said, well, the speeds are the same, the gradients are the same, it is parallel. And they connected all of those things without even any effort on their part, or what seemed to be any effort on their part, because the software had made it visual, the questions had taken them through it step by step, tiny step by tiny step, and so they, they'd learnt those things and internalised them without even realising. In the Better Games activity, they got to create some of their own characters and create little races. They got to be a bit creative and try some things out for themselves. very easily brought out misconceptions in a way that the students were able to see for themselves, oh, now I understand, just by a simple question. Some of them really stretched themselves and took it on a totally different plane. They nearly all mentioned the Wendell activity. I think the best thing about it was that it could visually contradict their misconceptions. Um, so for me, not just having to say to them, that's not right because of this number and this number, but that's not right because look at what this picture is showing you, um, made a much stronger impact on them. There was one child called Harry, and um, he actually said, so I've never understood this before, but you know, the fact that I could do the equation, I realized that when I change the gradient, it gets steeper. And that, for me, was just like a turning point. A ground-breaking movement was when they um, discovered what velocity was. You know, it seems like a very scientific word. Um, and then they just said, oh, it's actually quite simple. It's just speed with direction. Teaching it this way, they found easier to understand than teaching it the way I would normally teach it to Year 9. So that was enlightening. One really good aspect watching a lesson in Stratford School was um, seeing the pupils notice what speed looked like um, in the table and trying to spot it on the graph. It wasn't quite as explicit and the table you could see that the numbers were going up and when they made that link, a lot of um, the times when I've taught mathematics, we just don't have those three um, representations together and they made the link and I just found that really exciting. The one thing that we did the presentation on which was Better Games um, and it was highlighting the whole concept for me um, about the intercept and starting from somewhere which, which isn't the origin and I think they dealt with it in this um, in this project very well because they focused so much on speed and the steepness of a graph for a long, long time, and that really cemented what the kids had learned. And then, having done that, you kind of isolated the learning and focused it onto the intercept, and I thought that was the most important thing that I learned from the project. And some of the graphs literally went backwards, and we had a very constructive discussion, a whole class discussion, about why that would be incorrect, and then boys would be you know, they will actually go on and say, well, no, that won't be correct, and this is why. And, you know, the, the feedback they were getting, it was more from them than me. And that was the most important thing. I think that was fantastic. And the fact that we could link together a simulation with the algebraic function and the graphs, all three together, was just fantastic. Initially, I was very sceptical. I was like, I'm really not sure. Now, I mean, we're really excited about the unit and the project. I mean, I am, I'm very hooked up on it because I can see the impact that it's having with the, my pupils. 
and there was a wonderful time when a group of pupils talked about, today we got it. We really, we were a bit confused, we could understand various parts of it, and today we got equations. We're definitely going to use this unit again, it's going to be something that we embed. It's, it's, for us it's not a trial and we're very excited about it. Yeah.